Ricardo Magni here with a series of exciting updates regarding the Arnold Classic. It's less than seven weeks away. It's so exciting. This is going to be our biggest contest ever. So for those of you that have lifted with us many, many times, you are in for an unbelievable weekend of lifting. And let me just kick it off as always, there's goods and bads. Let me just start with the bad, and there's only one. We are not going to be on the Schwarzenegger stage like we were last year. We were in one place exclusively. It was a phenomenal venue to display our super talented lifters. Well, the, the good news about that is no one's going to be on the Schwarzenegger stage. It's It's gone. And the reason it's gone is because that whole area inside the main pavilion is going to be replaced by sponsor booths. The reality is money talks. And uh, the Arnold Classic is a fitness expo designed to make the, the industry a lot of money. And uh, it got turned into booths out of our control. Now the good news. We have been selected. Now, let us let me set the stage. There have been several, six sports that have actually been cut from the Arnold roster due to their attendance, their space, their professionalism by the organizers of the respective sports. There are six sports that have been totally cut that are no longer competing in the Arnold Classic. Thankfully, we're not one. And in fact... Everyone's watching when you, you, me, all of us are lifting, are competing, are hanging around. We're all representatives of the sport at the highest level. And luckily, we have been chosen by the organizers to be on the main stage of the Arnold Classic. Now, this is unprecedented. We've never been in the main stage. We first started off in the hallway by the Arnold uh, statue in 2019 on a, a made-up platform there. So now on Friday from 5 to 7 p.m., our ladies will be on the main stage of the Arnold Classic in front of 20 plus thousand people. So, so exciting opportunity for uh, some super strong women athletes to go out there and show what they can do and show their skills and talents. Not to be outdone by the ladies are 125 and 125 plus. So that's 275 and super heavyweight men will be on the main stage Saturday from 5 to 7 p.m., possibly a little bit longer. So the details are still emerging because, um, to be honest, the Arnold Classic schedule is a moving target. Um, but you, those groups, all the pro women lifters and the pro super men and 275s will be on the main stage. And I wanted to bring that to you with 100% certainty and a guarantee. Um, now, with that, is there are some responsibilities that are incumbent on the athletes. Look, you need to be where you need to be when you need to be there. And probably it's a good practice to be wherever you're supposed to be 15 or 20 minutes early. Understand, you're not walking through Costco on a busy Saturday afternoon. You are navigating through twenty to 30,000 people. The Arnold is 10,000 tickets ahead of last year's sale schedule. There will be more people, even for, for someone like me or other seasoned vets who've been to the Arnold many times, there will be more people this year than they ever have had before. So you need to be where you need to be and you need to be there early. Now, we are going to have three venues. All the schedules, when they're going to become final, are going to be posted. I'm going to make YouTube videos on it. Everyone's going to know where they need to be. Again, if it's your first time there, 
do everything early and reduce the stress. That's my message of the new year. Get there early, reduce the stress. Now, to that end, uh, me and my staff are going to be extremely busy. We have more athletes than ever before. And uh, signups are still going on. The pro signups are going to end this week. So if you're someone that thinks you're going to sign up for the pro and you don't sign up this week, you're probably going to be out of luck because it's almost full. So there's a few selected uh, international athletes that have uh, gotten in touch with me that haven't signed up yet. But for all intents and purposes, pro signups are just about over. Um, that leaves the Sunday contest left to sign up. So we're going to have fewer weigh-in times because we have more competitions. So you really need to be where you need to be to do the weigh-ins in order to relieve any stress. Um, if you have questions, feel free to email, text, call. Um, I'm Instagram message. I'm very accessible to answer questions. Um, we'll have much more detailed information. But for those of you that are, are training hard for this, know that your effort, your work, it has not gone unnoticed. Not by myself, not by the Arnold organizers. And that's how we get rewarded for doing a great job and bringing great, talented people together. You're going to be on the main stage lifting in front of 20,000 plus people. It's, it, it touches my heart. It's so exciting. Um, it's a great development for us as athletes and, and for me as a president of the league. And I'm very, very excited. So um, reach out with questions. I can't wait to see all of you. Like I said, we still have uh, several spots in the Sunday open competition. Um, again, if you're newer or you haven't qualified as a pro, it's a great way to experience the Arnold Sports Festival and uh, check it out. All right. Until the next update, train hard and I'll talk to you later. Bye.